We got the cousins, uh, some cool stuff from about 1960, and Leona Boyd, uh, she's such a terrific old guitarist, and uh, this is there's a lot of acoustic stuff on here, and David Gilmore's on here as well, um, a lot of other people too, Ray Cooper, Dean Garcia, etc., Andy Newmark as well, uh, and uh, from favorite recordings, of course, our favorites, Charles Maurice and Company, Brazilian disco boogie sounds, and you combine Brazil with disco, you get sumptuous, scrumptious, exotic cocktail lounge, jet set soundtrack for the beach boogie set. There's golden rings on the fingers flying the synthesized funk on here three tracks and they're all lovely and delicious there's even a casio keyboard on here that's really cool uh, just uh, super highly recommended and so is this never thought we'd get this but uh, they only made 500 copies uh wan chai records made in hong kong it's all about hong kong on this this is true hong kong groove and it's rare groove uh, they made it for 7-Up back in 77. It was a promo uh, record. Sweet and smooth, yachty AOR throughout. Disco funk, sparkly, fresh, quality, deep down, low down grooves from the Pacific Rim. Fender Rhodes fapping and Nitra zoomed direct to the Space Disco Lounge. This is great. And there's a, like, a lot of good tracks that you'd know. You know, I Shot the Sheriff, etc. Disco Fied, Boogie Fever, Sneak and Sally Through the Alley, etc. But Hotel California and just really good versions of it. And Vronsky and Babin dances for two pianos. Uh, they were considered uh, really one of the top uh, piano duos of the 20th century. This came out in 68, and also a great Cleveland connection. They were uh, from Russia, but uh, they came here, and actually Victor Bevin uh, was the director of uh, CIM for years, and it's also signed, so this is a terrific good thing. There's a lot of Tchaikovsky on here, uh, Copeland, uh, Stravinsky, etc., uh, and Massinelli Sid uh, and Cacciatore and some ballet stuff here from the 70s. It's very scarce. And we got some cool Christmas. This one's from 1980 and a lot of interesting voices on here. Not just uh, the regulars like Perry Como, but we got uh, Henry Mancini, local guy from Maple Heights, of course. Evan and Costello, we got a lot of old time radio stuff. And the now sounds, uh, we always love this stuff, and this is pretty cool. And if you look closely, they're basically like high school freshmen here. So they wanted to get the kids into the groovy sound, and it does. They do a lot of stuff here: Spirit in the Sky, Rainy Night in Georgia, Evil Ways, etc. Let it be. Uh, but it's really psychedelic pops, uh, softy rock stuff with the now sound. Really good. And Bucky Shirakata, great Hawaiian uh, musician, and uh, all his records are amazing. They're really sought after too. We don't really see them. Uh, this might be the first one. Uh, we've ever grabbed and we're always looking for this stuff uh, it's a uh, japan press of course and it's beautiful and a uh, midnight band gil scott heron and kmac i believe they were out of portland of course the k the other side of the mississippi out west and the w's are on our side but uh, i believe it was a college radio station but we got some good soul funk and jazz funk here secrets is a good one and realize a uh, terrific beautiful amazing record combinations well actually every track is good on here but just listen to that stuff is amazing rbl posse uh, gangster rap from the late 90s, uh, 97, Eye for an Eye. Yeah, he lost one, and uh, I believe he's the only surviving member of that group. And Eddie Harris, uh, a lot of jazz funk on here, and there's some comedy, too, spoken word stuff, recorded live, actually. Some was recorded uh, in L.A., I believe. Um, uh, some of it's in Illinois, uh, Minneapolis, but, uh, yeah, in Redondo Beach, uh, not far from... Uh, Tony's on the pier and all those other great places. Uh, Sir Douglas Quintet uh, Minocino. They were from San Antonio. Uh, good groovy psychedelic rock from the era. And Mike Curb Congregation, they did a lot of easy tempo stuff. And this is Put Your Hand in the Hand. It's kind of now sound gospel pop. And the Surfers, uh, they're a great Hawaiian band. And they do that number as well as 1900 Yesterday, which is one of our great favorite Hawaiian lounge uh, tracks. And they do The Impossible Dream and more others. And it's at Hop Louie's Latitude 20, which was in Hawaii. Uh, of course, Latitude 29 down there in New Orleans is run by our buddy Beach Bum Berry. And Hop Louie is a great uh, retro Chinese place in L.A. But uh, we did discover it's not the oldest, as a lot of people thought. The oldest is in Oxnard, a chop suey place. And we, uh, Hawaii Jano and all those uh, luminaries, uh, enjoy it. And uh, we got the green vinyl, uh, or actually, this, I'm sorry, the black vinyl of... Uh, uh, Quiet Village, sealed brand new uh, from our buddies over at Jackpot, who put out the good stuff. And Willie Nelson, uh, this is also a sealed beautiful reissue, just a copy of the Hard to Come By 1962 debut album. And we got more of these, too. Uh, Mustafa Azkant, uh, which is beautiful stuff. It says it right there, Electro Lounge, Turkish jazz funk, psych guitar luxury, and that sums it up. And uh, it's, it's really considered a holy grail for DJs and people who like good music, so we got it. And from our old buddy Ken Kesey, The Acid Test, if you're into the dead... If you're into the hippies and all that stuff, the hate Ashbury, uh, and of course, uh, 60s literature, well, this has got it. Uh, a lot of rare recordings on here. I'm 
believe Neil Cassidy might be making an appearance on here as well. And uh, we got Croc doing Croc, uh, kind of interesting too. Prague Electronica, kind of like a Beatles uh, doom pop. And Colossal Yes, Loosen the Lead and Spoil the Dogs. If you're into classic rock, here it is again. Power pop, classic rock stuff, brand new. And the Howie Mather Trio. This is actually a really rare Cleveland record. Betty Robertson and Billy Kay, and this was uh, recorded right down the street from us, uh, the Park Brook on Brook Park Road. And uh, I have it on good authority that they actually used to have mermaids in there, just like uh, some of our favorite places in Florida. Um, so pretty cool, beautiful old jazz. I know they do like Bill Bailey and a bunch of other good lounge numbers of the era. It's a 50s thing. And make a tello disco great again. Uh, they don't have to do much to do that, but this is a lot of good, uh, cool, cool stuff. And, and there's some modern housey sounds in here as well. Uh, but it's a great import. You know, it's just not around here in Cleveland, but we've got it. And we've got this one too, Passaporto per l'Italia. And uh, there's a bunch of our favorites and a lot of great people singing Italian stuff from uh, Chet Baker to Neil Sedaka and many others. And this came out in 62. This has been lovingly reissued and it's got the holographic stamp of approval. So these and more. We're all here at the current year this weekend 5580 ridge uh open for pickup friday saturday this weekend 11 a.m to 6 p.m and record store days next saturday so it'll be all chaos and we do pre- promise to uh post a flip as soon as we get the stuff and uh, it actually has not arrived yet uh we hear a lot of record stores are also waiting so we'll see what happens but we'll be here 